It's been a long time we saw. But it's like you're not happy to see me. I don't want you anywhere close to my child again. My mother goes nowhere. <laughs> into this house. I have lost my peace. You are no one. Ah, my. Shut, shut, shut up, shut up, shut up. When are you going to stop? When you die. When you marry your own, she be you enjoy your husband. I bet you don't enjoy him. Any man whose mother is still alive is a violent person. There will be no food for you in this house till I decide otherwise. Go on the floor. Master! Keep rolling. My help cometh from the Lord who made heaven and earth. If I ever see you close to that old witch again, you won't like what I will do to you. If you're as wicked as other mother-in-laws, she wouldn't have the mouth to talk to you like that. You must explain to the people what you're doing with your mother because I believe there's more to this nonsense. If anything happens to my mother, I will put you in that same condition that she is. Look out for! That I'm keeping quiet does not mean I'm a fool. Do not take advantage of it. You must stop whatever you have with Baba. All right? We need peace and tranquility in this house. Look at me go talk with you, Shut up your mouth. Sandra, you must apologize to my mother. Apologize to both of us. I will never marry any man whose mother is still alive. If your mother is sick, take her to the hospital. Get her someone that will take proper care of her. The Lord is my shepherd. I shall not walk. What about your mom? Is she dead? God forbid. I cover my daughter with the precious blood of Jesus. Grandma is very sick. I think we should take her to the hospital. If she's sick and wants to die, let her die now. 